Hey guys, I just got something exciting in the mail. Exciting to me. <laughs> I finally got my soon veggie ramen uh, that um, Mommy Tang recommended. Can't wait to try it. I heard it's spicy though, so we'll see. If I don't like it, Luis probably will. I also got my new Joby for when my new camera comes. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys. <laughs> I talked about it on my live stream last night, but I didn't tell you guys that I ordered a new camera. I'm excited. It doesn't come out till June 9th because it's a new version of uh, the Canon G7X Mark II. So it's not going to come for a couple weeks, but I ordered the tripod along with it. So this is the bigger, better version of the little one that I use for my phone. So I'm really stoked. Excited, excited. I can't wait to get my new camera. I'm sure it's going to be a lot of fun to play with and get to uh, learning. My family's watching the It crowd and eating dinner, so I'm going to go for now. Hey guys. The boys are back there. I don't know, you can't see them because of the light, really. Hi, Garyan. Hey, Logan, are you awake? Yeah. Logan's resting. We're sitting in the parking lot of Walgreens. Luis ran inside to get a pair of earplugs because uh, his seat is almost we're going to going to a concert tonight at the Brooklyn Bowl. Um, mm. I have never been there before. It's at the Lincoln, you know, downtown Las Vegas. So it's going to be our first time at that venue. Uh, the show starts at 8. The doors open at 7. It's 6.42 now, but we don't need to get there early because I don't know who's opening. And uh, most of the time, if it's an opening band that I don't know, I don't really want to see them because Honestly, if I don't already know the songs, I'm really not that enter entertained <laughs> unless I already know the music. So uh, I don't care if I miss the opening bands. So anyway, yeah, we're going to see The Used. So one of my favorite bands. This is their 15th anniversary tour and I'm excited. So let me know if any of you guys know The Used and if you like them or if you love them as much as I do. So I am super excited. And as soon as he gets back, we're going to head to my parents because we're dropping the boys off. At my mom's she's gonna watch them and then we'll come and pick them up after the show so I'm thinking I might broadcast live on Periscope a little bit of the concert we'll see see if I can get a signal in there I'm not sure like how bad you know the building is for for uh, getting a outside signal or whatever from, from my phone so we'll see how it is but anyway I'll show you um, I'll probably take video too of some of the show so depends on how far away from the stage we are or how good I can zoom in but anyway Hey you guys, I'm in my mom's restroom and she just recently redid it. So she took off the mirror off the wall that used to be here. It was just a big, you know, rectangle average mirror and she put this cute mirror. She made it all look all nice and there used to be a big cabinet thing like this over the toilet to store stuff and now she's got these little perfume bottles and the flower picture that she got at a uh, Ikea and these are little votive candle holders and then there used to be an avatar movie poster here <laughs> because that's her favorite movie and she changed it for this pretty flower picture and then she's got this little fairy set up over here it's really cute when i lived here the, the floor was linoleum and it was peeling up because our cat used to pee on the floor all the time now it's this pretty tile it's actually been tile for a couple years now but Overall, this bathroom is like super pretty compared to when I used to live here. When I lived here, it looked pretty ratchet. <laughs> but yeah, it's really cute. I just wanted to show it to you guys. She got these little birdie pictures up on this side. So yeah, it's a really nice bathroom. I wish that my bathroom was this nice. I should take notes. <laughs> oh, and this little tree, tree god guy thing. This is really cute too. The potpourri in it.
so many of our dedicated fans how they've told us that these records, especially in Love and Death, have had something to do with them living a better life or maybe even actually saving their lives. I want you to know that that story is my story as well. I've been through a lot of really, really, really tough things and this record saved my life as well, so thank you guys. Song's called Hard to Say. beautiful wild animals, right? If someone falls down, you pick them up. It's simple. If someone falls down, 
You pick them up and you kick the shit out of them. This has been almost my favorite show of the tour, so thank you guys. We'll see you real soon, Las Vegas. This song's about how fucking pretty I know I am. I love them so much. And they put on an amazing show. Time to go head back to my mom's to get the boys.